Hey guys, welcome to the channel, taking a bath in the bathroom. It's the only place you can place you guys is in peace. On this channel, we do product reviews and also some tutorials. If you want to support the channel, go ahead and check out my ebook, bang, www.themanisetthemselfonfire.com. I also have a PayPal donation link in the description of the video. All right, we're going to get right to it now. Guys, please be careful out there. Make sure that you're washing your hands and you're paying attention to your local authorities. Now, during this time of crisis that is worldwide, it is a pandemic. The coronavirus is taking over. Make sure that you're not a casualty. Pay attention, guys. Stay alert. Now, we've been placed on a stay in place order, meaning that we can't really go anywhere unless we have a reason to go, like grocery store and stuff like that. But during this time, man, I spent a couple of moments just looking around the studio and I came across a box that I didn't even know I had. So let's go ahead and unbox it and let's see exactly what's inside of it. I can't tell you what it is, what it do. We're going to find out the specs as we go along together. Then I'll come back to the studio and share my final thoughts with you. OK, so here we have it. Uh, your Galaga, I believe that's the name of it. Now, I don't know if this is a knockoff of the A95X. But it seemed to be a good little box. Go ahead, take the box out, throw it to the side. Now you're getting your bases up in here. You're getting a remote control. You're getting a user manual. You're getting your power brick. All of your bases, guys. Now this box is rocking 4 gigs of RAM and it has 32 gigs of storage. So some nice little specs. It's a nice little remote control right here too. But you know, we don't use that. We use third parties, guys. You gotta have a Bluetooth or a UBS remote control. You also gonna get an HDMI cable and some more literature up in here. Now this just about everything you have in the box. Now having a look at the device itself, guys, the device itself is light, but it's very you know it, it's very popping or catching to the eyes to be honest i think this is a nice looking box guys they did a really nice job with it but we know how these android boxes goes um you're getting the usb ports on the side one three usb port getting an sd slot of course you're getting a slot for your um a port for your hdmi cable and of course you're getting a spot to plug in your power wire the basics i love that it have the ethernet port in the back and it's also dual wi-fi that's very very important 2g and 5g all right let's see what it's all about all right so here we are got the box connected that's what you're going to see you start it up so of course i speak english so let's go to next all right ah I, I think i can live with this um basically just adjust your screen size go to next and we want to find our our router see what sorts of internet we're going to use so choose my internet i got a couple of them guys and put in my pathway right quick all right i'm down here and let's connect to the wi-fi as you can see it's dual so you got 2g and 5g a lot of times these budget boxes only come with 2g and they give you a little lay of the land so basically showing you how the interface is going to look before you even get into it giving you um all of the status and everything so that's a nice added touch so let's jump right into it uh, i'm not going to set up the remote control guys i'm using a third party remote control i like to use little usb remote controls but if you want to set up the remote control or learn the functions of the remote control here you go right here all right so there we go we are in here and the first thing i want to do is go to the settings i want to make sure that my time and date is correct go to more settings And you can see about device device name is y1 model y1 android 9 back out four gigs of memory you so it got four gigs of ram on here guys it got a little over 27 gigs of storage on here so it's probably 32 gigs of storage four gigs of ram so that's not bad. It's not bad at all. You can see all your apps from here. And of course you can set up your account, Google account. Go to our time and date. Set up our platform. 24 12. Set up your time zone.
got your sound, accessible, uh, advanced. All right. Thought it had Bluetooth, but no Bluetooth. I'm not seeing Bluetooth on here. Let me just make sure. Nope, I don't see Bluetooth on here. Like you can come right here, check your display, HDMI, back out, more settings. Just making sure no Bluetooth. Yeah, no Bluetooth. All right, so let's go ahead and jump into it. So the first thing I want to do, guys, is I want to download file link. See what type of browser they got on here. So they have Chrome and they have Google right here. So let me go into Chrome. I'm going to go ahead and download um, file link. I'm going to add some APKs in there and I'll be right back. All right, so let's go ahead and see exactly how these rounds going to push this box so let's download it and see how long it takes for it to download all right now it's a combination with the box guys and also your internet speed now i have great internet speed so it should download fast if this box really got those four gigs okay go ahead and press okay and wow look at that <laughs> that fast guys that fast all right all right all right so let's go ahead and um, make sure that we turn on install unknown apps and let's see how fast it takes for it to install all right then we see how fast it downloaded let's see how fast it takes for it to install okay go ahead and turn these um permissions on get out of here all right let me go into the apk and open it up apk installer on this device and open it up all right usually these devices have an apk installer if you don't have an apk installer guys you just go right here to the file browser i don't see an apk installer uh go into the file browser go to your local go to your download and it's right there all right and let's let's install it and you can see this little box is snappy guys very snappy very fast look at that look at that install time and we're done just that fast guys just that fast all right let me go ahead and add some apks to here okay so we are up in here in super dell tv file link to grab a couple of uh, apks for my here Grab the cinema hd and yeah guys you can see it's moving guys it's moving that's lightning fast all right let's install that you gotta go and set up the settings for it again let me go ahead always right back out of here just gotta allow it to install unknown apks and this thing is flying Well, let's do that. Get back up in here. Done. All right, let's go grab some more. Hi right, Panther. Wow. Might need some updates for some of these. Movies. Popular. Let's just see 2016. How long it take for the lengths to come up? Now, of course, the lengths guys are not on the device. The lengths are on the server of this APK, wherever they have, or whatever scraper they're using to get the lengths. The delay could be coming from them. What I want to see is what happened when we find a link and we click on the link, will the link play? How rapidly would it play? So it's taking a while to get some links right here. Like I said, I probably need to update this APK. I don't know if Superdad had this APK updated in his um, file link store. Let's back out of here. I'm gonna try one more, then we're gonna move on. And of course, if this if this do not pull any links, I just come back to this APK later and um, see if there's any updates. Uh, I never used Black Panther before. I just wanted to get up in here and see if it would work. Back out of here. Let's go to uh, 
the design i already know i gotta update this so let's just go ahead and update this guys to the new one and yes we want to go ahead and give it the permissions Want to allow Black Panther to update too, just in case. All right, All right. Let me go back to TV Zine. Open it up. Okay. All right. Like it's asked me for more access. Like I said, man, this this apk right here is an old apk so i don't know if it's modded or not so hopefully we can get up in here not having luck with the apks today guys all right let me go ahead and update this and be right back all right so we got tv sign installed guys basically what i had to do is uninstall the old one go to the website and reinstall the new one all right so these are are the updates and the fix to TV sign. Uh, don't sleep on that West World, guys. Don't sleep on that West World. Go ahead and just see if we can just open up something random. All right, let's go. Press play. See if we can get some links. Now, I don't have my real debris connected, obviously, and I am a um, member of Design Club, but I haven't connected into that. I just want to see exactly how it's gonna play all right so let's go ahead select play see what type of link we got here and here's the thing man you get these little random links you can get some of that but let's see if we can play a while with our buffering see if i can scrub it a little bit back and forward let's just see So yeah, yeah, it's a little slow, but man, it's hard for me to tell unless I knew I had a really good link or not. But it's doing the job, playing it pretty good so far. Back out of here. No buffering right there. Don't want to play it too long. Don't want to get a copyright strike. But yeah, it's handling IPTV well, handling TV sign well. Exit out of here. And it's a nice interface, nice smooth interface. It just flows. You know, it flows to each their own, right? Let's see if YouTube play on here. I don't know how old this box is. I keep saying it, guys. I just found it. I know, like, a couple of months ago, like, Netflix and YouTube, if it's not, like, a certified device, you, you will not be able to play it on there. Oh, yeah, look. look like, it's playable just that fast so we can play youtube on here back out of there and let's see what else we have up in here guys go ahead and clean things up free up a little bit of space that's your setup wizard wi-fi display yeah you're not you're not getting much and i and i like that you don't have a lot of bloat up in here you know let me put what i want on my box Let's go ahead and download it and let's see how long it takes for it to download from here. It's downloading. Alright, let's go ahead back to our file, open it up, and install it. You can just see how smooth the transitions are. It's not it's not any lag up in here. You can see, look, I even downloaded it twice. That's how fast it was moving. I pressed it twice and downloaded it twice. Yeah, it, it's moving. And we done just like that. Let's open it up. Bang, that was quick, guys. All right? Got the code in. And let's see. They can play a little IPTV for us, USA. 
and you can see how fast the logos are loading up so yeah those rams really pushing guys look at that now again it's a combination between between the rams and your internet but look really pushing let's see open up cnn transitions are really smooth guys really smooth really fast we already know that da streams is a awesome iptv service and look at this box man it's just pushing it i mean this is just a, so far i can't believe i had this just hitting away it's a great experience so far yeah you're not you're not getting much and i and i like that you don't have a lot of bloat up in here you know let me put what i want on my box this is a nice little setup guys a nice little box all right let's jump back into the studio and i'm going to tell you what i think about it all right guys welcome back so as you can see the box is very snappy four gigs of ram 32 storage it basically can handle anything that you throw at it now let this be a lesson learned if you don't have your own file link and you go into someone else's file link just um know that you're taking the chance of the apks not being updated properly so if you don't know how to update the apks or you don't know where to go to get an apk that you got out of someone file link store that might be um deficient make sure you do your homework don't rely on just one person file link store i rely on dst file link stores because i can pick up the phone or shoot them a message and hang out and say hey update this apk when you have time something like that or i just go get it for myself you are not me so don't put yourself in a position to where you're totally relying on someone else as you've seen i had to do a couple of things to get tv sign working other than that man this is a great box i'm I, I you know i'm blown away that i had this box and i didn't even know that i had it but guys there you have it um once again stay safe can't say that enough if you want to be a reseller you want to know how to sell internet guys it's a perfect time a lot of people use the internet a lot of people need internet go ahead look in the description of the video everything you need to know it's an unlimited unthrottled hotspot guys look the video to show you where to go the website where to go to purchase it hundred dollar donation you can have that also if you want to be an iptv reseller i'm working with two iptv services they're putting together a package i have a video that i'm asking a hundred dollar donation for and it's basically teach you how to set up a website where to go um how to promote and stuff like that when i say where to go like who to resell from stuff like that but um working on something else two IPTV tv services they're putting together a package and it's going to be fifteen hundred dollars and what you get for fifteen hundred dollars is a rated made company you get in the website get an automated payment um center meaning people go in there they pay you they get the username and their password you're getting 100 reseller credits to start off with guys and you're getting the rebranded apk fifteen hundred dollars so shout out to those two companies um hopefully you guys get your act together soon because people are asking me to update the video it's your boy taking the bathroom until next time peace don't forget to subscribe 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 stay safe don't forget to subscribe and also hit that notification button so you can be up to date with all of my latest videos